And when it comes to budget repair, the reality is that this government has been in office, but not really in power. Reformers can't lose heart, even though a government with a solid record of achievement has just had its majority slashed. Our challenge is not to move closer to Labor in the hope of being a smaller target. We have to show some fight in the things we believe in. We, know we may not be able to do all that we would like to, but we have to demonstrate that we know what that is. Our country, after all, has just voted. People voted for a government, not a vacuum. Tony Abbott um, said on, on Friday, he said, you're in office, but you're not in power. Do you agree with that? No, no. That, that would, what, the, on the basis that we don't have a majority in the Senate, that would suggest the only governments that have been in power um, in, you know, you know, in, in recent times have been John Howard for a few years and Malcolm Fraser for a few years. Look, the governments normally don't have a majority in the Senate. Governments normally, historically, have to negotiate with other parties in the Senate. It has been ever thus. That yeah. is, that's the nature of our system.